Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Warhammer 40,000 Armageddon. So, we just finished this mission here, and we're going to go on to the next one. So, let's see what happens. A successful action. Your exploits have been noted, Commander. I am glad at least one of us is keeping the faith with the Golden Throne. The battalion has now done all it can. Infernus is lost. It was always going to be, ever since its governor declared a surrender. Even now, I'm receiving vidscreen reports of the orcs mercilessly killing and enslaving, while other Xenos beasts are pouring around the Paladus Mountains, threatening to cut you off from the rest of the forces. You must retreat. Although it might already be too late, the Greenskins have been spotted on the outskirts of Diablo Mountains. We are truly lost. Uh, let's see, what are our options? Focus, if all our faith is being tested, and the best way to overcome such crisis is by performing your duty. Yeah, no, that, the second one is just me being like, yeah, no, we're totally boned, and that seems like a bad idea. Um, so, how about we do the first one? You, you are right. I will focus on my duty. Hopefully, I will come out of this stronger. I have received word from Commissar Yarrick. He requests you bring your forces to Hades, if you can break through the Greenskin Cordon. It will not be easy, as you must cross or circumvent the Diablo Mountains. I have plotted two possible courses for your battalion. Crossing the mountains is hazardous, but you stand a good chance of evading the bulk of the Orc hordes. Or you could go around the mountain chain, but this will mean you will inevitably encounter the Greenskins in large numbers. Oh, okay. I thought I was going to actually make a choice there, but it looks like they're actually just throwing me on a map where both choices are present. Okay, let's uh, have a look at this. Oh, wow, I have a ton of points to reinforce with. Uh, da -da -da. So it looks like... Where's my actual objective here? Shit, I was not paying attention. Mission objectives. Move at least 12 steel legion units to the far right of the map. Okay, so it looks like my options are I can go through here. Uh, which I assume is, you know, through the mountains and the route that will involve less orky death. Um, or I could take one of the roads, which will be presumably a more direct route, but also more dangerous. Uh, I think, what with the large number of tanks I have and with the fact that my troops are mechanized, we might be better off trying to force our way down this road here. Uh, and definitely not going this way, because this way looks like certain death. Um, yeah, let's so uh, let's give that a try. Let me just see what I can get by purchasing stuff, though. What do I need? I need a new company commander again. God damn. You gotta wonder who the poor bastards are that keep signing up for this job, because it never seems to go well. So I feel like, you know, looking at this thing, I think it's an amphibious transport. Like, I think I could use it to cross rivers if I wanted to. But it's kind of hard to tell. I'm going to stick to the chimeras because I don't need to cross the river at this point. There we go. Get a new company commander. And I need a new heavy bolter crew. Do I? How many points do I have? I've got six slots left. Uh, let's, uh... Well, first off, I need to replace my tanks. Grab another upgraded Lehman Rust. I, as much as I like the Conqueror and I like having the, the extra armor on it, uh, the... Like, the two heavy bolters on the side are just really good against orcs. So I think I'm going to stick to those. And I need to replace my basilisk again. Well, I guess I think that's actually the first time I had to replace my basilisk. So pick up one of those. That is a lot of points that I'm using. Okay. Can I get vultures? How much do vultures cost? 645. I can actually just get two vultures. There we go. Yay. Oh, uh, you know, shit, I should have got salamanders, actually. Damn it. I love salamanders. Oh, well, too late now. Okay, so how are we going to do this? Well, I guess we'll put the tanks in front. Tanks. Tanks. Vanquisher right behind them. Earthshakers behind them. The vultures can dick around on the flanks, because that's kind of their job. Ah, the infantry. So you guys are, I guess, I'll just put you kind of generally around the place. There we go. Alright, um, so we are on offense, I think, which means we should get to go first. 
Yes, I'm correct. Okay. Alright, vultures. Let's go do some scouting. Huh. Hey, look, there's a little, like, mining building in the side of that mountain there. Cool. Ah, there we go. We found the orcs. That did not take very long. Pew, 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 pew. Pew. Okay. Uh, and how about you? Just come up over here. Or armor engage these assholes. You, uh, you can just move up to, oh, there, I guess. Move you, oh, wow, you can actually get those guys from back there. Nice. Just start moving you along the road, I think. The Earth Shakers can also hit these guys. Ah, oh, Basilisks are so good. Alright, I'm gonna pull you out around the building here. Jesus, you can even hit these guys. There we go. Alright, we're gonna go out this way. And let's see if we can get the infantry into combat here. Which we should be able to. Hello? Okay. Oh, I see. So the little red indicator there under the under these group of orcs, I think means that they are providing fire support. Cause yeah, because I'm out of range of both of these guys' weapons, but I'm still taking casualties, which I assume is coming from them. And I'm actually not taking, you know. Not doing too well in that fight, so I think we'll pass on that. But we can move our chimeras up here. Move our AT team up. They might actually be able to. Yep, they can hit them. Just range. And we'll move the rest of our troops up as well, I suppose. Alright, focus down those uh, support units. Wow, I have 21 turns to do this? Wow, Jesus, give me a long time. Okay, just keep on, keep on. We're gonna keep all our forces together because I think it's that's our best hope. Uh oh, oh, you can shoot at things. There you go. Uh oh, and yeah, why not? Now that we we can there support you in a little bit, you guys can fire as well. Okay, here we go. Let's in our turn, the orcs are. Not doing a whole lot, honestly. Okay, well, we should probably deal with those shooter boys. In all honesty, there we go. Yeah, see the the twin heavy bolters on the sides of the uh, upgraded Lehman Rust is just really good. If I move this one up, he should be able to get rid of the last of those support troops. There we go. And then we can just kind of shred these guys with regular infantry weapons. Ew. You are out of range. Good, good, good. Really? Really with the one orc left there? There we go. Okay. Now we can move the vultures up. So they can, you know, scout a little bit. Move the tanks up as well. And I want to be careful not to move the infantry too far ahead of the tanks so they can actually, they don't need to get in the chimeras just yet. Basilisks, and last but not least, the anti-tank crew, and the company commander. There we go. Alright, so far, so good. And then the orcs just didn't take a turn, which is a little bit worrying, if I'm honest. Do I even have 12 troops? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, okay, good. 12. I have 13 troops. Wow, okay, so if I lose 2 units then I failed a mission. Well, that's good. Hello! Lots of orcs. I really wish there was some way to, like, move slightly ahead, rather than just moving ahead at full speed at all times. Alright, you have three range on all your weapons, so I can park you... Actually, let's park you here. There we go. And then I can move, you have more range, yeah, which means I can move you up to here. There we go, let's go to them. The Vanquisher can then park here and, really? One, two, oh fuck, I miscounted. God damn it. That is my mistake. Okay. The Earth Shaker's up and let's, Jesus Christ. Uh, I think I want this one dead. 
you. Let's see what the other is triggered. Ah, oh, damn, he can't get into range. Oh well. That is a shame. Okay, now is when we move the infantry up. Have them start engaging things. Or we don't have the infantry move up because they can't reach anything. Woo. That is unfortunate. Well, uh, wait, don't I have one more vulture? Oh no, both my vultures moved. Well, I really hope they don't just, like, destroy that vulture because that would kind of put me in a bad spot. They are destroying that vulture. Yep. Shit. Well, there you go. If I lose one unit now, then I've failed the mission. I am in the process of losing one unit. This is going well. This is going very well. Okay. Tanks up. Scared of them. Need to get line of sight on the chumps behind them. Please. There we go. Look, I know there's tanks there. There we go. Okay, now I can move the Vanquisher up. How much range does this have? Okay, it's got one force, so it's going to be able to shoot the Vanquisher anyways. I may as well just shift it up to here. And get as much damage as I can on it. There we go. And the Earth Shakers can fire from here. And move up. Fire there. There we go. Shift the Vulture up the infantry up as well. Uh, that's not really worth it. Move up. That's also not worth it. I can't get my freaking AT team into position. Uh, oh right, I've got units that can shoot but probably shouldn't. Wait, did I? Oh my god, I forgot to move one of my fucking infantry units. Awkward. And the orcs took a super fucking short turn. Phew. Uh, can we get rid of this guy, please? Thank you. Vanquisher sure doing work. Okay. So that's what... Well, we're like, what, halfway down the road? Eh. Let's just keep going, I guess. We may be a little bit more cautious about our movements here. We've got, after all, a ton of turns here. And it seems like the orcs are going to be defending this pretty... You guys can wait. You can hang back a little bit, actually. Let's uh, keep the infantry a little bit more to the front now that I think about it. They're a bit hardier than the uh, vehicles. Move you guys up. Okay. There we go. And move the tanks up in support. Oh, you guys. Uh, oh, right, you're kind of waiting back here because you were running out of troops. Alright. Again, the orcs are not doing anything, which is kind of worrying me. Like, they're just not taking actions. Hello, orcs. Uh, yeah, let's try and find some cover before we start, you know, shooting all of the things. Chimera, bring up the Vanquisher other armor, which cannot get into range just yet, but the vulture should be able to, what is it, 1-3, so right about there should do, yep, that's perfect, you guys can just wait back there, I need to be really, really careful with them, because I'm, like, I don't have that many troops, like, I can't lose any more units, so, uh, and I don't really have the resources to reinforce them either. Alright, so, Vanquisher. Can hit them. You, there we go. And let's, uh, I guess... Wow, we can engage, like, none of these people effectively. That's because they're, like, standing in the open. Alright, you guys are just aren't going to fire, because I want to conserve... Wow, Jesus Christ, we can't fight anything. There we go. That's got that, at least. Uh, the Chimera. Uh, I guess we'll just focus on those support units there. Alright, we wore them down a little bit. Ooh. Alright, so you guys need to move into cover. There we go, the vultures. Actually, uh, the vanquisher I don't really need right now, but move the 
standard Lehman Russes up. And they can go with this asshole. And we can move the infantry. Ah, damn it. I really want them, like, I want them to be in cover here, but they can't get here without mounting up, which reduces their, like, firepower. Which is kind of annoying. Um, I can move the vultures up, but not into cover as well. Move the vanquisher up. There we go. Armor support. Okay. Let's move up a little bit. Yeah, checkers up. Bring the vault. Really, the vulture can't go anywhere. Wow. All right. Fair enough. Just keep on keeping on. There we go. So far, so good. Oh, those look like yep, hard boys. All right. Uh, they do not have ranged weapons though, which is good because that means that you can probably. Just sit back and plink. God damn it, I still <laughs> I keep getting in the same situation where I just can't get my guys into combat, like not in their chimeras. Uh well if you're gonna be in your chimeras, I may as well just park down the road. And move the vanquishers up as well. Are there seriously no like other orcs here? Is it just these guys? Like I'm not complaining. I don't I don't mind there not being any other orcs, I just it's a little bit weird. Hey, um, you guys may as well move up at this point. I need you. You're the more like they're the more like reinforced bunch at the moment. They have like the highest number of troops, so I need them closer to the front. You guys can move the earth up as well. Since these are the only targets we have for this turn, we may as well just like devote all of our firepower to them. What about you, Vulture? Vulture is getting lost in the mountains and having some trouble. You. See, this is why melee only units are a bad idea. Like, they're just getting shredded. Uh, Alright, well, let's see what they do now that they're surrounded and there's only three of them left. Oh god. Oh, oh god. Only four guys left in that unit. Run away! Alright, so... Get rid of those guys. There we go. And we'll move... God damn it. Move you guys up to here. There we go. Move you guys up. Move you up. And... I don't know that you guys are going to be able to get into... This you can sit here and now, because then you'll take a bunch of casualties. But we can move the other up at least. And the vulture. Why is the vulture moving so slowly? I thought this thing had way more movement before. Oh well. And our two little reserve guardsmen units at the back there. Okay, so, Earthshakers. What do I want to deal with? That thing, probably. Actually. No, the Ard Boys. Ard Boys with shooters sounds like a problem that needs dealing with. Wow, we're actually almost at the edge of the map already. Uh, the Vanquisher can hit this thing because the Vanquisher's, you know, good at killing tanks. Oh my god, that thing almost died from that. Jesus. Can I... No. No, I can't even damage that thing. Alright. Focus on the Yard Boys then. You might be able to, though. Ah, damn, so close. Uh, that's, no, there's no cover there. I'm just gonna leave you there. Alright, so we kill this thing, and then we're, like, right at the edge of the map already. Jeez. Except to not lose any of our units. And the orcs didn't do anything, so that shouldn't be too hard. Alright, so where is my vulture? Okay, there don't seem to be any units in the way. Put one of the Lehman Russes. No, we seem to be okay. This is way easier than I thought it was going to be. I feel like I'm going to regret saying this. Like something terrible is going to happen in a minute. Let's 
So am I just supposed to like spread my dudes out in a line over the edge of the map, or do I just need them sort of nearish to the edge of the map, or what? Greetings, Commander. Oh yes, no. This time I'm talking only to you. I have been following your exploits since your arrival on Armageddon Sekundus. I can't decide whether you are brave or foolish. Either way, I could do with a strong ally like yourself. So choose your friends, Ken. I note you are heading towards Hades and Commissar Yarrick. Don't get too enamored with the old man. His time will not last. When Hades falls, so will he. And where will that lead? Well, all right then. Um, let me just make sure I've got the mission objective correctly. Move at least 12 steel engineers to the fire of the map. Okay, yeah, so I think I am in fact just supposed to like form them up in a big line along the edge of the map here. So if we just move you guys up here, you know, spread people out a bit. Uh, do I have to be like at this square or does this square count? I really wish they were a bit more clear about this. Park people as close to the edge of the map as I can get, and then I'll sort it out later. I'm assuming the squares, like, that are kind of adjacent to the edge also count. Uh, yeah, just go this way, I guess. Alright, Ben, now that we've reached our sort of objective, and we're all on the road, why don't we all just space ourselves really fucking far out? Okay, there we go. I won. I guess I I was close enough. All right, there you go. Uh, let's have a look at the map. Review map. Okay, so had I chosen to go north, uh, that seems to be about the same amount of forces that we fought on the way in here. Looks like a little bit less armor. Uh, and had I chosen to go south, oh yeah, that would have been that would have been fun. Yeah, that would have been a terrible idea. Alright, well, there you go. We have successfully evaded the orcs and made our way to... Well, I don't know if we've made our way to Hades Hive yet, but we're on the way. So, um, that's it. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.